starting off with, of course, everybody knows. A lot of these everybody knows uh, because they have been very popular events that have happened globally. Uh, this one happening in Surfside, Florida, the condo that collapsed, the half of the condo that collapsed, uh, people, uh, tons of people are still missing. Uh, many have been recovered dead, uh, but just a huge tragedy out in Florida. Uh, which it's crazy that like I understand it's like it just fell at no point have I seen anybody try to explain why it fell what made it fall you know I don't think I think what my thought is on why it fell especially the fact that it's in Florida a state that's very red and and one of the tendencies for conservative states is to a elim- they, they really love to open the door up for giant corporations or anybody with money to really just just profit off of negligence and and just just horrible business practices right it's it's very much a a political party that allows corporations and and people to profit off of ridiculousness uh and 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 for people to bear the brunt of all of the mistakes and 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 shortcuts and uh and things i think it was a fact that there's probably especially since a lot of florida uh there's a lot of cocaine drug money in florida uh but just florida in in general i would imagine substandard building codes or people being paid off you know whoever owned that building whoever built that building uh probably built it to substandard uh you know whether there were regulations or not or they paid off to get around regulations either way buildings shouldn't just fall down right unless it's like building seven and nine eleven uh you know where that's just more of a sympathy fall uh but uh you know the, no no explosion it wasn't during a big storm you know no hurricanes thing just fell as far as i'm maybe maybe they just don't talk about it but they did mention it's like hey this happened because of this thing i think it's because of somebody with money whoever built the building built it to a horrible standard they cut a ton of corners probably used uh horrible materials there's probably a lot of ways in which the the person that built this building cut corners uh and and got away with it you know so that's like something like that happening should 100 be the uh, be blamed on the the person that built it but also the government of that state because it's their job to make sure things get built to a certain standard and it clearly wasn't done because it's like what i mean you it's not like great weather conditions out there it's got to hold up to some stuff you know uh so it's a tragedy that probably was caused by uh, a, a wealthy person making a ton of money and no consequences will ever come to whoever profited off of uh, making a building that just falls down like that. Uh, so that's, that's the, aside from all of the death that it caused, uh, it's a tragedy that the system allows for wealthy people and giant corporations to just completely get away with murder. Murder. As far as I'm concerned, whoever built that building knew what they were doing, and blood is on their hands. Blood is on the hands of the government that did nothing, that allowed a building like that to be built. So uh, I feel sorry for those people uh, and for the families that have lost people, but, you know, that's, uh, it's, it's sad, but it's, you know, that's kind of the story of this country. The, the, the majority of humans that, that work and build this country are generally shit upon and torn apart, chewed up and spit out. Uh, but if you have money, you can get away with stuff. You can actually make a lot of money. It's easy. It's almost effortless to make money uh, when you have a lot of money because you're able to get away with things. You can, you, can, you can break laws in ways that no ordinary human would ever be able to do and not even pay taxes on it.